So in this lecture we are going to discuss about repeating radial gradients. In our last class we have discussed about only radial gradients but in this class we are going to learn how we can repeat these radial gradients. So this is the coding from the uh, last class and this is the output you can see it is here. Now I'm just going to add here repeating hyphen radial dash gradient and I'm just going to remove this circle just from here for right now and this percentage also. Just you can say or just 20% I'm just keeping this. You can save now come here and refresh. So just remove this comma control s and a refresh. Now you can see this just the repeating or radial. You can see again, 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 and again. So this is called the repeated action. And as I told you, by default it is on ellipse. Ellipse. So you can see there is no changes for right now. But if you are using here circle, circle, you can save and refresh now you can see it is just in circle mode but we have some more property for this like closest corner here you can just try to see l o s e s t dash corner corner you can just save come here and refresh so this is just closest corner and you have just farthest corner farthest corner you can just write f a r t h e s t farthest corner you can save and refresh so we have just here closest site c l o s e s t closest site you can save and refresh so this just closest site and we have farthest site F A R T H E S T farthest site save and refresh. So there is just some little bit different for this. So anyway, this is called repeating radial. So you can see it is just repeated again and again. So that's why if you just cut this one from here, just this one repeating. You can just control X and save. Now come here and refresh so you can see. It's just on radial mode. We are going to paste this and save. Now you can come here and see. So you can see this just repeated again and again. So this is called a repeating radial gradients. So I hope you are understand. Uh, in our last two and three classes, we are just discussing about uh, gradients, linear gradients, repeating radial gradients, or just linear gradients so i hope you are understand you need you are just doing some practice so i'll see you in the next class